Hey ladies, it's Nisha and I'm back with another video. Um, and today is going to be something a little different. Um, I know y'all used to me with the installs, sew-ins, you parts, all that. But today, um, I'm bringing you guys a full lace glueless wig from RPG Show. Um, I know all of you guys have heard of RPG Show. It's like all over the tube. Um, everyone that has an RPG Show wig is like madly in love with it. Um, so I was really excited when I got contacted to do the review. Um, because I've never experienced anything from RPG Show. Um, so of course, wig comes in this box. You guys see this all over. Um, lace wig, 100% premium human hair. It has all their contact information on the bottom. Um, the inside of the box, what I got, uh, was a, like a mesh wig cap. A neutral color mesh wig cap. It also comes with an instruction manual. Um, it has like all everything that you can think of how to install it um it even shows you like a braid pattern that works well underneath your um your lace wig um they give you suggestions on what to wash the hair with they show you different types of wigs that they do offer um so it's really good booklet um you know it just helps you out as like a reference book type thing <laughs> um and i also got a flat iron um so that's what i got inside the box so let's get to the wig um what I did was I actually put the hair up in a bun um, just to show you guys what the hairline is looking like. I'm going to release the hair in a minute, but I just figured this would be a better way to show you guys what the hairline is looking like. So you can see, um, you know, all the curves and stuff to the hairline. I figured pulling it up, it'd just be a lot easier. So this right here is like the little air tab. This piece of go, you know, in front of your ear. Kind of like your little sideburns. <laughs> um, this would be considered your sideburns, your ear go here. Um, here's the nape. It's baby hair all around the perimeter, as you guys can see. So this is what it looks like. So this number here is the ELS 119-S. The hair color is 1B. Hair length is 20 inches. Hair texture yaggy. Um, the lace color is light brown. The cap construction is a cap number three. Sorry, is a cap number three, and the cap size is a number one. Um, so that's basically what I have here. I'm gonna just take this stuff down so you guys can see what the hair looks like. Okay, so it's very bouncy, very flowy. Um, it has like a, a, a very natural feel to it. Um, very, very natural. So this is 20 inches. And again, um, this is the lace color, if you guys can see right there. Um, most of the time, when well, most of the videos that I saw, they were doing like a medium brown lace. Um, and I was kind of scared to get the light brown because I didn't want my lace to be too light. But I don't like for my lace to be too dark. Like when I'm wearing either a closure like this is right here. Um, if I'm wearing a closure or I have wore lace with like lace fronts before, I never done a full lace wig. I need to see some part in like I need to see a part. Or I'm just not going to feel right. So I figured I'll go with the light brown lace. And if it's too light, you know what I'm saying, I'll just darken it. Um, but the lace seems like it's going to be pretty cool. But let me just show you the parting on it. Now the knots are not bleached. Okay, here's what that looks like. You can see a stocking cap underneath it. Um, but the knots are not bleached. You see those black dots in there? That's what the knots are. So the ones that don't know what knots look like, that's what it looks like. Um, you can part the hair anywhere. So it looks like scalp all over. Okay, so let me show you inside of the cap. So what you get um, are three combs, one on each side, um, basically where the temple is, and then one right in the middle. There's no combs in the back, but there is an adjustable strap. So this is what makes this a glueless wig. You don't have to glue the wig down um, to keep it in place. If it's too big, you can just pull these straps here and it makes it, you know, fit to your head. In the middle is a stretch cap. Um, it just gives it more pull. 
So if your head, you know, is a little on the larger side, you have that stretch right there just to give you a little extra room. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much what it is. Like I said, um, this is the light brown lace. The hair feels really, really nice, you guys. It feels like relaxed African-American hair. Um, this is a 1B. It's kind of like a really dark, dark brown. You guys know I like, I love dark hair, so I was a little nervous. I was hoping it wasn't going to be too brown, but it looks really good. I like the color of it, so I'm not going to have to dye it. I may go in and bleach the knots, so though, just to give it a more realistic look. Um, let me show you what it looks like on my finger. Okay, so this is what it looks like on my finger. As you can see, like, the lace, like, it just disappear basically so once you get those knots out of there and it definitely looks like it's coming out of your scalp um, what I'm gonna do most likely is take this middle comb out and place it in the back that way I have something you know to stick under so it won't come up um, and that's pretty much it I'm not going to glue it down like you know on my scalp what I'm gonna do is the same method that I use for this closure which is using um let me show you the got to be ultra glued styling gel and the got to be blasting free spray. And I'm going to do it behind my hairline so it just look as natural as possible. Um, so what I'm actually going to do is just wash this. I'm going to wash and condition it. Um, and yeah, I'll come back in another video and show you guys what it looks like installed. I'm going to do a tutorial though because I had a lot of people that want, you know, wanted to know how I put my closures on. So I figured I can do it with this RPG Show wig. So, I mean, it's pretty much the same concept. Um, RPG Show is having a sale that's going on right now. And I will have all their information down below. I have the link directly to this wig here in case you want to pick up the ELS 119S. Um, I think it's really good. It's a really thick in density. It's not one of those really thin wigs, um, but it's not, you know, ultra thick at the hairline where it's going to look like so wiggy. I think I'm, I can get this to look really natural. Uh, that's why I'm excited to do this. Um, I've seen a lot of YouTube reviews on this one, which made me decide because when you go on RPG show, like, you can get a little bit overwhelmed because they have so many wigs up there and you like, okay which one did I go to so what I did was just I went to YouTube and just typed in RPG show wigs and all of them came up so you can go and look at the different one you know different ladies that try different wigs and see which one you like so this is the one that I went for so um, like I said I'll leave a link to this down below um, I'll also have like some sale information for you guys in case you're interested in going and picking up you guys a wig. Um, so yeah, I really appreciate all you ladies taking this time out to watch this video. Stay tuned for the install video of this RPG show uh, full lace glueless cap. See you ladies in the next video. <laughs>